joined by Parama Pal, one of three co-captains for Australia. Not the result you're after today coming into this one. Yeah, obviously not. Uh, we knew Sri Lanka would be coming really hard at us, and we were ready for the challenge, but unfortunately we didn't get our results, so well done to them. A little bit of a different storyline today with Sri Lanka winning the toss and putting 230 on the board. Were you, were you always confident you could go out there and chase that title down? Yeah, definitely. The way they started, they looked like they were going to get 300 plus, but it was credit to our bowlers. We came back hard and we restricted them to 230, which I thought which was par, and we were confident going in for the chase, so it's just unfortunate that the result didn't go away. Look like a few different bowlers. You say yourself probably more with the ball than we've seen so far this series, and Austin War as well, really pulling things back in the middle overs. Yeah, it just shows our depth. Like it's good to have a variety and see new different bowlers, and it's just unfortunate to be honest. A couple of partnerships there with the bat yourself and Jace at the start. I mean, what what was the difference? Do you think between the two sides? I thought they ran really well between the wickets and their intent was really good during the middle overs. I thought we lost too many wickets in clump, myself included, and we just left it too late. It went down to the wire and I guess credit goes to the bowlers, Rancico and Daniel. As much as you want to talk about the team, it must be nice for you to come out and get 100 in the first game and then tick past 50 again. You must feel like you're in pretty good nick. Yes, pretty good nick at the moment. It's just cashing in, I guess. Probably throw away another 100, but... Yeah, that's cricket, I guess. Just got to come back the next day and come back better. With 10 overs to go, sort of needing 6 and over to win, were you confident in the guys that they could get there and get you over the line? Yeah, definitely, especially with Lorne out there being one of our main sticks. It was, we were confident going in. It's just unlucky, I guess. And where do you go from here now? One all in the series with a bit to go away and work on before the third game? Yeah, definitely. So we got two days rest between our next ODI and we got a couple of things to work on. But yeah, we'll come back on, on the Aussie spirit. Thanks very much. Good luck for the rest of the series. Cheers, Nick.